The sheriff's department says a female deputy is lucky to be alive after being brutally attacked by an Ingham County inmate. It is our top story at five. Thanks for joining us. I'm Sherry Jones. Those in law enforcement know that staying out of harm's way is a challenge every day. And while many times they deal with mayhem out on the roads, they say it can be just as dangerous in lockup. And that's what happened yesterday when things took a violent turn for an Ingham County Sheriff's deputy who was hospitalized after an inmate attacked her. Shamir Owens spoke with the sheriff and she's here for you now with how that deputy is doing tonight. Shamir. Sherry, Ingham County Sheriff Scott Brigglesworth says a male inmate awaiting trial for murder made a plan to attack and beat a female corrections officer at the jail. With less than a year in corrections, the female deputy went to do a routine safety and well-being check on the inmates yesterday. That's when a male inmate with a history of violent behavior at the jail punched the deputy in the head and face multiple times. She was able to call for backup and was taken to the hospital for her injuries. Ingham County Sheriff Scott Rigglesworth says she's lucky to be alive. He planned this. Uh, he ambushed her. He did this purposely against her. She's since been released, um, is recovering at home, and then kind of to be determined when she'll be able to come back to work. And But for the responding deputies uh, being able to uh, get to her when, when they did. Who knows what this could have turned out to be. Sheriff Rigglesworth also said that he is grateful to the Ingham County prosecutor who made a personal visit to the deputy in the hospital. The detective bureau at the Ingham County Sheriff's Office is handling the investigation. We will keep you updated on this developing story.